Yard and blood tooth. Berserkers make fierce foes, but powerful allies. His strength would bolster our settlement. I should seek him out. An inspiring tale. Far more fitting than that terrible day. At least you changed my name. And she got a dragon in. Always with the dragons. Eivor, if you've a moment to spare... Petra, what is wrong? It's my brother. Wallace was meant to return hours ago, but I've seen neither hide nor hair of him. He's usually punctual. I'd like to search the woods for him, but alone I fear I would have little luck. Would you join me? Two could cover much more ground. We should go now. Do you know where to start? Near Peterborough. It's where he buys his tanning liquids. I know he sometimes makes camp at a crossroads between here and there. We can retrace his steps. We can retrace his steps. With luck, he hasn't done anything foolish. Is he prone to that sort of thing? Never. That's why his absence worries me. I told you how we found him, didn't I? You did. Led by a white elk to a lost babe in the woods. A fated encounter. Fated, yes. As if gifted from one guardian to another, he was bestowed on us like a... like a babe among the reeds. Over there. He may have stayed somewhere nearby. If he did, he left traces. Oh no! Eivor! Over here! A set of tools. If they belong to Wallace, why would he take them from his satchel here? 
That leads below ground, to who knows where. Let's keep our wits about us. Careful, Petra. Look at his eyes. There's something wrong with this one. Strong scent down here. Strange and heady. I don't recognize it. It has a familiar sourness. I can't place it. Not the smell of death. It is almost pleasant. Must be Wallace's clothes. The trousers are wet. Probably pissed himself. Someone was wounded. A knife attack, I think. Hmm. Wallace stayed here. Seems he made something to eat. Oh my god, Eivor! Eivor, come this way! What have you found? I saw it, Eivor. I saw him nearby. Wallace? The White Elk. The White Elk that brought me to Wallace years ago. Petra, where are you? Petra, hello. Mimi, guide me. Have I lost her too? Petra! Show yourself! It's getting dark! Ah, the elk. He will know where she's gone. I am... I'm sorry to trouble you, Lord. Eivor, nice to see you here. Are you the White Elk Petra told me about? <laughs> of course I am. Look at me. It may be you can help me. Petra has disappeared. I need to find her before the sun slips away. No, no. Petra hasn't disappeared. She's close, very close, and waiting for you. Follow me. You are the guardian of this place. You live a comforting life. Out here among the hills and dales of Mercia. Oh, I get on, you know. I eat, I sleep, I frolic. I want for nothing and enjoy every moment. It is a decent life. And what are you and Petra doing out here? And what are you and Petra doing out here, lurking about in the woods? Hunting, maybe? In a way, yes. Uh, we are looking for her brother, Wallace. She's been waiting for him all day. Oh, my dear, yes. Where could Wallace be? Oh, where? Oh, where indeed? Ha! <laughs> Is Petra near? Uh, I fear we've lost her. She was here a moment ago. Well, what is happening? I cannot stay. Not here, not now. Take your evil back to Sutunga's Hall! What have you done with Petra? The little hits take a toll. What have you done to Petra? Answer me! Abel! Stop! They're here! I will make them talk, Petra. I must know the truth. I must know where you are. Abel, I am right here. There is no need to question this carrier further. Oh. Uh. 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 
Sorry. Now come. I believe I know where we'll find Wallace. Up there. His trail leads this way. Petra, I, I met your old friend, the White Elk. But he vanished before my eyes, before I found you. You were visited. For a time, we talked until he vanished into the empty air. A shame, really. I enjoyed his presence. Ah, look there. This is strange, Seda Vitra. Where are you? Petra, how are you doing this? There's no trick to it. I think about it, and it works. Easy as walking. Try it. Again? Petra, how? <clears throat> how can I do that, Petra? Yes, just try it. Move! Run in a straight line! No, 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 no! Too far! Too far! Amazing! You did it, just like your Sunin! And not a scratch on you! Now let's go. Wallace should be over there. Are you sure Wallace is here? I, I see no one. I believe so. We should ask the rabbits. They will know something. Of course. The rabbits. We've been here before. This is where the wolves attacked us. Right. Let us hope their spirits are not restless and that they do not wake to maul us. Oh no! The wolf spirits have wakened! Good thing. I see him. I do. Come on, Eivor! Chase the elk! No, no, please don't disappear! Not now! Ah, not until we have Wallace! No! No! Don't go! Wait, wait. We're home. Full circle with nothing to show for it. Uh, so what are we looking at? Wallace? You stone brain stoat! We've been looking for you! And here I am, freshly rested and ready to work. You're days late! I was carrying quite a burden coming home, slowed me down some, so I made a camp and picked some mushrooms for a nice soup. Turns out I picked some funny mushrooms, sent me into a tizzy, tore off my clothes, woke up naked and bruised in the woods. So I snuck home, naked as the day God made me, and grabbed some clothes. Now I'm off to get my tools. <laughs> mushrooms. So the elk, just another dream. Maybe so. But don't scoff at dreams. They are often worth more than our waking hours. 
I may still be bussing from these mushrooms, but this is nice. I had fun today. Maybe we could do it again. Without the mushrooms. We could. But I will have to ask the rapids for permission. Can't raise the sail here. Sing, my ravens. Run up the sail. Hey. Well in Hall of Kings. On ocean speed, my words gain wings. God will bring for noble deeds thine honor sing the brave man slain ulterior way reward for strain to ball hath paid and horns resound the mighty horn for those who fight for those who fall Ravens scan the battlefield. The beaten blaze, our trail of bread, loathing gaze upon the dead, and horns resound the mighty horn. For those who fight, for those who fall, for those who fight. 
There cease called the money. When I was 11 winters old, I was the youngest of my favorite cousins. A wild and rowdy bunch of boys and girls. Together with our parents, we attended a feast at the home of Halpdan the Black of the House of England. To toughen our patience... Oh, my brother! Die! suggested we steal a keg of meat, drown in happiness for our good work. Uh, so Guthrod, Mikkel and Orsa snuck into the storeroom and stole the barrel as I stood watch. But when we were spotted, I froze. Three of Harold's men stopped us. They struck Guthrod and Mikkel and pushed Orsa to the ground. Whose idea was this? They asked. I stood and said, the idea was mine. The meat is for me. One of the men eyed me and said only, no other that man is either. not true. Then, they moved on. Sing us a song.
Take the mask down. Set the mask up. Hold on. All sail. Continue. Be my eyes, Zulu. Blacktooth's cave should be close by. That must be Bjorn and the Sargo. My eyes cannot forget the sight of her. Her hair so long and falling down. Oh. A man who fights beside a great white bear. You are Bjorn Bloodtooth. Ask the dead. What do they tell you? They say... We do not want shapeshifters in these lands. They wished me dead. They are not the first. And you... Come to make your name in battle. Another corpse at my door won't matter. I'm not here to fight you, Bjorn. I am Eivor of the Raven Clan. And I offer you a seat in our hall. I have no clan. And no need of another. You prefer to live alone here with your bear? I prefer vengeance against the man who hung my wife and left her for the crows. Who is this man? A Mercian lord, whose name shall not sour my lips. He has scores of men, an army perhaps, but that will not stop me. Then let me help. If you truly wish to avenge your wife, you must not fall in battle. I shall think it over. Njal, go with my bear. Feel her belly. And if Njal trusts you, who knows? Maybe we do as you say. You're tame for so wild a beast. Is that so? Tell me, what does a bear like you eat? Whatever you want, huh? Best you show me then. Skald say Bjorn carried you into battle when you were but a bear cub. Raised you as one would raise a child. Your favorite flowers? They are not food, Njal. Reminds me of summer in Norway. We had fields like these near Hemingas Hall. <laughs> I can see why Bjorn keeps you around.
lake. There's fish you want. I can help with that. Fishing arrows. Now, something from Yao. Ready, folks.
You want some fish, Njal? Here. <laughs> Nothing better than fresh fish. Eat your fill, friend. A strong war arm, Raven Shirt. These men did not come for the fame of defeating a legendary berserker. No. They were followers of the Mercian Lord. My blood enemy. My wife's killer. How did your wife die? 
Fame has two faces, Eivor of the Ravens. In Norway, many a young Thane wanted the glory of killing me. They died. I grew tired of killing. Alfilder and I, we came here for a new start, a quiet life. But fame sailed ahead of you. This Mercian lord learned of your deeds, sought to boost his own name with your blood. You have the right of it. Only he wanted me to drink the Berserker brew first. When I refused, he demanded. Offered gold, even taunted me. Then he... He hung her. Arfhilda. Your blood feud is just. But if it is something you must do alone... No. Your words are wise. I do not want to die fighting. I want to die knowing my wife is avenged. I want to kill that man. Help me. Tell me what you need. Nightshade. It's the last bit of magic I need for my Berserker brew. You shall have it. And when this is over, I trust the Raven Clan will have your axe. When you find the Nightshade, bring it to me beneath the gallows tree south of Beodoric Swarm. Nightshade often grows near graveyards, and Saxons build their graveyards near churches. Nightshade grows in graveyards. No shortage of those in Christian England. Nightshade has a distinct stench. Like this. That is enough, Nightshade. Foul smelling herb. I should meet Bjorn.
as promised. Your nightshade. Good. It has the power we need for the coming ritual. Nearly done. The Skalds say Odin hung himself in a tree much like this. He lived, though. Most die. Yggdrasil. The world tree. Odin's gallows. The place where life and death are one. Ride with me, Raven. The Sather awaits. Berserker brew hits hard. It may open your eyes to the spirit realm. It may turn you into a savage beast. Whatever happens, face it without fear. War breakers born in battle's flood. What do you fight for, you bear skins? The wolf shuts you drinkers of blood. We fight for glory, we shield biters. War breakers born in battle's flood. I've been close to death many times, but this, this was different. Ah, feels like a Jotun kicked my head in. Tis glorious, is it not? Berserker brew does not... Does not agree with my belly. <sighs> but you live still. Can you feel the power of the bear's blood coursing through your veins? Yes. But you, you were a bear. And the bear power courses through me still. I'm ready. Where to? The Mercians who slew my wife cowered in Beodorchsworth. We shall kill them all. With me! No! Y'all will taste mercy and blood! Show me what you can do, Berserker! Ah! 
Let's end this. Strike for Christ! That's enough! Yeah. Ah! 
with me. Let us leave this blasted place. I feel great. Bjorn, your enemy has fallen. You have your revenge. Yes. But now I fear I must ask you one last thing. Should you be willing? What is it? Njal is tired. I will tend to her beneath the tree where this all began. Please, bring us some of her favorite flowers. They look like... I know the ones. I'll gather them and meet you beneath the gallows tree. Stay strong, my child. Bjorn is here. I saw some of Njal's favorite flowers growing beneath the gallows tree. His wife's grave. No wonder he visits this tree often. Flowers for Njal. Now to meet Bjorn beneath the gallows tree. I 
brought her here, where it began, where it ends. I understand. They hung my wife in this tree and buried her among its roots. A grim and undeserved fate. We took Njal in as a cub, she and I. No children of our own. Now both are gone. Yet I remain. Dear Njal, you were always at my side for the better years of my life. I must have done like this. Njal sleeps at the Allfather's feet tonight. Yes. They let loyal hounds into the Hall of the Brave. So Njal too is there. With Alfilda. Before, you asked if I would join your clan. I am ready. Good. There will be a place for you in my longship and in my clan. I shall sing of Alfilda and Njal during our travels. Sing of their deeds. And I will carry their names into battle. When you're ready, follow the River Nenna to my settlement. We shall welcome you as a brother. I will be the Berserker of the Raven Clan. 